how to do the time control animation. So first of all, you need two clips. The first clip is where the movement happens. So in my example, it's me in the car. Cut this clip where you want it to have. I want to start here and I want it to end when I'm leaving the frame. And then you need the second clip. In my example, it's me talking and doing this hand movement where I want to control the time. And then I want it to end about here. So that's very important when you film it, you need to film it on a tripod, so there's no movement. So you can see I have this clip and then the second clip and it's exactly the same. And that's important, when you don't do it with a tripod, it won't work. So now I have the car on the layer below and me talking on the layer above. Because now I'm going to mask out myself, so it seems like I'm in this video. So there's two ways how you can do this. In the free version, you go over to the color page, create a new node and create an alpha output. Then go here to the Windows tab, select the pen and now you need to create a mask. Doesn't need to be that perfect for now. Like so, should be enough. Then just track the mask back and forth you need to adjust it here and there so that my arm is in the frame. You see in the free version that will take some time. Now I show you the second way how you can do it in the studio version. Take your clip, open it in the fusion page, shift spacebar, type in magic mask, then create a mask over yourself, click on better, deselect what you don't want to have. So track it back and forth. So when it's finished, go back to the edit page. And now you see you've masked yourself out and you're in the same frame like the car. So when you play it, it looks like it happens the same time. Yeah, that's me driving. Now you can take your car and can do pretty much what you want with this. So what I wanted to do is here when I snap, I want to stop the car, so I place the car like here, out here a little bit more, and here. And now you can just play with the car, right click and make retime controls, so you can change the speed. You can do it in the Fusion page, but I think for this example it's easier here in the Edit page. Then just simply click here and now I want to stop the car here, so I make freeze frame. So I have from here on freeze frame. So it comes and boop, stops. And then I want it to go backwards from here. So I set here a little cut. So I go here to change clip speed, reverse speed, change it. And now you see the whole clip is reversed. So easy tip here, just take your marker here. And now you know this is exactly the same frame like here. Just drag it here longer, set the cut here, delete this, take this back. And now this is exactly the same frame. So that's just a quick example how you can control time. Car comes, stops here and goes backwards. And you can do even crazier things with that. So feel free to test it out.